Dot. The video discusses a recent UN Security Council resolution demanding an immediate ceasefire in the conflict involving more than 32,000 Palestinian casualties, specifically for the duration of the Muslim holy month of Ramadan. Despite the resolution, which also calls for the unconditional release of captives held in Gaza and compliance with international law regarding detainees, there's skepticism about its implementation and binding nature, particularly from Israel and its key ally, the United States. The U.S. abstained from voting on the resolution, which was otherwise supported by 14 countries. Marwan Bashara, Al Jazeera's senior political analyst, provides insight into the situation highlighting that the resolution's effectiveness hinges on U.S. leverage over Israel, which seems unlikely to be exerted. He criticizes the resolution as a mere pause rather than a serious attempt at a ceasefire and points out the U.S.'s role in complicating what could have been a straightforward resolution. Bashara suggests that the resolution, while symbolically important, is unlikely to lead to a lasting peace due to Israel's historical non-compliance with U.N. resolutions and the U.S.'s continued support. The discussion also touches on the broader implications of the conflict and the resolution for the U.S.-Israel relationship, with Netanyahu expected to focus on securing support from the U.S. Congress. Bashara concludes by emphasizing the disparity in support for Palestinians and Israelis at the international level, with Palestinians relying on the U.N. and international law, while Israel benefits from robust U.S. legislative backing. The video paints a grim picture of the ongoing conflict, the challenges of achieving a meaningful ceasefire, and the complex geopolitical dynamics at play.